I've been asked since salted pilchards work, salted squid, uh, prawns and uh, yabbies work. Uh, how would you go with cut bait? Uh, so I thought I'd give it a try. I bought a couple of mullet today. Same again, we're going to be using our celebration containers. One's with the holes in it for it to drain, the other one with the drainer below. Putting in salt. I'm using used salt again. The more you use it, I think the better it is because it gets the smell of the salt through it. Has been re-dried out in the sun. Got a couple of sides of mullet here that I have actually cut in half and patted dry. We'll put them in facing side down so if there is any moisture comes out, it will drown downwards. That's one side. Cover with salt. I haven't done this before. This is just to see if it works and how it works against fresh frozen. Other side down. And the rear half. Give that 24 hours, we'll come back, pack her up, I'll take it out fishing and see how it goes. It's been a bit over 24 hours now. Oh, it's jerkified, just like jerky. The reason you do this is if you had the bait out, it's been frozen, thawed, and then you don't want to freeze it again because it does go soft. Or if you haven't got a refrigeration. In a container as always, I'm using non-iodized evaporated sea salt. Never use iodized, always non-iodized. The fish don't seem to like it. Bit of salt in the bottom. Bit over. Doesn't have to be full of salt. Seal it up. On a little bit of salted mullet that I did the other day. Done like jerky. And a little brim. Brim on mullet jerky. Something's up a bit in the water, doesn't it? Yeah, goes back to back mullet. To yeah. That's a beautiful little brim. They're a pristine fish here, eh? It's a beautiful waterway. And then as soon as they hit water, that it releases the oil. GoPro, start record. And another one. Salted mullet again. That's a bit of cut bait that I did. I found that all salted baits come up really good. Another cod.
gonna stop. Nice little cod. Off you go, little fella. Mullet well, is a dart, mate, though. I'm on this time. GoPro, start record. You nearly went in, you nearly got a blooper. <laughs> What's that one on me? 20 pound. Yeah. That's a brim. Salted. Salted mullet. Salted mullet. No sooner hit the water. Yep. And it was whacked. Excellent. Happen. Oh look, self-releasing. You get the good fish, you get the self-releasing fish. Yep. Oh, he's a nice little, yeah, yellowfin. Yep. Off you go, you got a long swim back to the... Long swim back, and that's what the salted mullet looks like when you put it on. Jerky. We shouldn't be telling people this, everybody be using it and there'd be no fish here. Yeah, I know. Got another reef, I think. Cod. It is a cod and gave me back my bait. That's a nice looking cod. That's a very pretty little cod, that one. The gold spot. Yep. And there he goes. Does salting mullet work? Yes, it preserves it, toughens it, and it intensifies the flavour. Which means it stays on the hook longer, the bigger fish to get it. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Click the bell for notifications and share if you like. You have a good day.